All right, I think we've got everything set up and proper and ready to go. All right, I think we've got everything. Okay. And this time I remembered, hey, hold up. I can set up my fucking uh, PlayStation 3 controller. I can even put the speed up button on it. So, I'll make things more comfortable at least. So, east to Mount Colts. That guy, there was that old guy who wants cider, but I'm not sure we need to get it to him yet. Huh. I don't remember where the fuck that shortcut was. Get out of the way. What? It's like, it's like in the back of a building somewhere. You gotta like walk into the back of a building. Nope, no elixir in that clock. Uh, we're stealing a bajillion of those. Ah, nice round number. Ah, we could use some more eye drops just in case. Echo screen. You know what? Let's just get three. You don't see silence a whole lot in this game. Three sleeping bags does cost more than one tent. Hmm. However, that's almost all of my kill right there, so. I think I'll just save it. So, I'm not sure the game has explicitly given us any direction, but east is Mount Colts, which I think is where Sabin is. Although, we might have to talk to the old guy for some reason, because uh, the whole thing is they were talking about, uh, Edgar and Locke were talking about, like, hey, you want to meet our leader? Uh, Bannon, I believe his name was. And Terry was like, whoa! Okay. Oh, wait. What is this? It's city's eastern border. Okay. Because didn't, didn't they... Didn't the Biggs and Wedge talk about attacking from the east? Uh, when they were going to Narsh. I think they did. Is this just treasure down here? Whoa! Whoa, 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 Ooh. A secret within a secret! Hold up. What the fuck is down here? Here we got the good shit! I think Hyper Rest just, like, increases strength or something. I think that's, like, haste? Hold up. Hold up. Nope. Hyper wrist studded bracelet that radiates a mysterious power. Yep. 15 strength. Or Hermes sandals. Casts haste on the wearer. That's pretty good. That's pretty good for this early on. Um, let's give you the Hermes sandals. And... I guess you can have that for now. Uh, you know what? Let's give you the jeweled ring. And you the silver spectacle. Tara can heal people with her magic as well, so I figured, yeah, why not? Okay, where where is that old rich man? Because I have a feeling that we can have uh, we can now have the ability to uh, go get cider from the pub. Okay, yeah, this was all treasure down here. Unblocked that ad for that sweet, sweet ad revenue? Was there an ad playing? I thought that was the thing I had to, like, explicitly opt into. I'm not 100% sure how the fuck Twitch even works. And I am recording this time. Although, it Looks like you're here for the whole fucking stream anyway, so... Other people can watch it, I guess. Uh, right, that dude's house was, like, at the back of some place somewhere. It's really helpful. Okay, let's talk to the actual barkeep. Can I... Nope. 
Let's see. Come here. Get out of the. <gasps> okay. Um. It doesn't seem like I can get cider anywhere. So I think I'll just head to Mount Colts. Seems a uh, good enough an idea to me. Oh, hold, hold the fuck up. It's a whole extra screen of town here. This ship isn't going anywhere. Well, then don't mind if I procure some amenities from your barrels. Yeah, he didn't have the dick. So I guess I'm outie. Everyone's all topped up. Tip top? Yeah. It's like a, almost a weird loading time when it's like leaving the pause menu. Uh, yep. Flame on them all! Oh, I should use Bio Blaster probably. Couldn't steal. I was gonna say fucking robbed, but I guess they weren't robbed. I was robbed of the opportunity to steal. This is like the little house where Duncan lives. Yeah, what the fuck is this thing? Oh, it's just a cabbage with a. I can work. Oh, it's like a cabbage and a turnip. I see. Can't remember if there's something in this well or not. Hmm, what's that smell? Smell? Something here? It was his favorite. Okay, so yeah, this is Duncan's place. These dishes, they're just like the ones he always used. It's either Duncan's place or it's just Savin's place. Oh! Apparently you can just do that. Just the three of us. I mean, there are three- oh, hey. They all work, apparently. But, uh, I mean, there are three separate beds. We don't have to, like, cram in. These flowers. He always liked these. Oh, and then Savin's gonna be there? Or... Could Savin be living here? I mean, probably. Aha! That's Duncan. Hey! We weren't trespassing. <laughs> do you happen to know where I could find the man who lives here? Sure do. Left a couple of days ago, soon as he heard Master Duncan had been killed. Headed up to into the mountains. They say Duncan's son Vargas is missing too. I don't like it one bit. Oh, just left out the back. Uh, okay, well, I don't think I can access the mountains from here. If I'm going by the white dots on the map, it looks like I gotta go around. Oh. Didn't have to go as far as I thought. I'm actually gonna do a proper save, El Manuel. Yeah, don't get to listen to Terror's theme. Mount Colts. Give him a water. I guess I can just like leave the water right, right in front of me since I'm not using the keyboard. It's not in the way of my arms. Zagrim! Oh man. Kung Fu fuckers. Nope. Shit. I keep forgetting it's the L button and not just like hitting back until you hit the back. Oh, okay. That's not the same as the uh... They heal from poison, do they? That sounds like bullshit. Yeah, just knife them. Or I guess great sword them. I don't think I've successfully stolen yet. Mm -hmm. okay. We're doing pretty good all just hanging back in the back row. Ooh. I saw that. I saw that sneaky shadow. Oh, I guess you guys probably didn't, because it was underneath where my face is. Hmm, a path? There's nowhere. And a cave! That might lead somewhere. Serpius. Maybe I can bioblast these assholes. Just 
Uh, 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 steel. Uh. Didn't matter. Okay. 82 EXP. 306 EL. Get in the cave. Ah. Oh, lots of battles. And it's always with something new, seemingly. Man, quit hit my dudes. And lady. Keep accidentally using all the crossbow. Like some kind of idiot. Oh. Must not have that much health left. Nope. Now, I wonder if this is like most Final Fantasy games where healing spells actually heal more if you use them in the battle. Can I go across? Nope. Come on, get up. I guess with the, the like fast walk shoes, you really only need to put them on one party member and they'll work. Eh, she doesn't really need to heal though. Since I know her heal does like a hundred and something health in combat. Maybe the internet could tell all, yeah. I know I know enough about the game to know like how to get the things I wanna get and do the things I wanna do. Their faces are redder than their pants. Trillium. God, you can barely even fucking make them out from the background. Will one auto crossbow just kill them straight up? Nope. Well, fire will probably do it. When in doubt, just solve your problems with fire. Mm, more caves, more paths. More mysteries. Mm. Or maybe they, may, maybe the monks instead uh, practice ritual sunburning. That might be a thing. Or maybe they're not human at all. Maybe they like Jace from the fucking Ginyu Force. Oh, he's like straight up crimson. Like, he's like straight up fucking Spinal Tap, none more red. If in you catch my drift. Man, they did such a good job with like the light coming in, the cave entrances and stuff in this game. Looks so good. Looks so good. Nope, nope, don't cure. Fire. Man, I don't know why, but like, analog sticks in this controller are slightly sticky and I don't like it. It's fine, since I'm not using the sticks anyway. Salt D pad! I need to get a new PS3 and or PS4 controller at some point since the right analog stick on this thing doesn't even work anymore. There are games I want to play where I kind of need a controller. Let's just leave. Oh god, we're in the front row. Oh, the damage. Ah. Uh. Ooh. Run lock. Run, you fool. He's, uh... He's just hanging it. There we go. Pretty sure there's a relic that prevents back attacks or some shit. Damn, their faces are really red. Maybe that's like face paint or something. Like there's a, there's only like ten pixels on their whole face, so like it could have some like intricate fucking design that we just can't make out at all. It's like you can't really make out Kefka's makeup from his sprite either. Yeah, there's Sabin. I recognize that silhouette. Get on the bridge. God, cloudy up here. Or smoky, or misty. Foggy? Could be. We'll never know. Nope, nope, yes. Just steal from the mammoth. 
steals delicious mammoth tusks. I wonder how the, the damage formula of auto crossbow works. Fuck, it doesn't seem to split damage at all. It just seems to do the same amount of damage from a number of targets. Uh, I guess I could get Terra to heal herself. And Edgar. But, uh... Oh, abilities? Yeah. How much does she heal out of combat? Eh, still more than 100. 150. Alright. Just do it outside of combat. She's low on MP, though, which is annoying. I might have to swap her to the front row and start fucking busting heads. A beautiful save hole! And there we go. No free heals here. Well, this place has been fairly straightforward, but I guess it is like... the first dungeon in the game? I mean, I guess there's the Mines of Narsh. I think I'm just gonna have to start... Ooh, fuck. Okay, well... We have ways of dealing with those problems. I need to organize this. Just, just hit it. <sighs> Turtle dungeons don't count. Hmm. I mean, it was a big cave complex. It wasn't really much tutorializing, either. I mean, if you want to get technical, I wasn't counting the first dungeon, because the first dungeon is when you go in with Biggs and Wedge and fight the Ymir, and then you get knocked out, and, like, go back through a different part of the mine as Terra and Locke. I mean, they explain the, the Moogle game, which comes back once later. Where instead you're actually splitting your act. Or no, does it happen twice? It happens once when you're on the cliff with the Yieldy Biggledy, whatever the fucking Esper's name is. And that's the first time you fight Kefka. And then, does it happen again in that cave? I don't remember. It happens at least once in the. F but it's, like, not really a tutorial for much. They don't tell you how the fuck to play the game, because back, back then, you used a fucking instruction manual for that shit. But I mean, since games are like... A lot of games are digital, exclusively, and stuff like that, you can't really have a manual. Though you could like, have it in-game, just like when you're selecting, like, you know, from like the start menu. You know, read the manual. As opposed to, like, most games' really ham-fisted attempts at a fucking tutorial. I mean, there's some games with amazing tutorials. There's Vargas. I remember him being kind of a tough fight. I remember him, like, hitting like a truck and having a shitload of health. You know, kind of the way monks do. <clears throat> Don't poison her. Nah. Ha! Shield damn bitch. Right. Uh -huh. Does poison last outside of combat in this Final Fantasy? Yep. Um sort. There we go. Much better. I should probably have sold some of that shit. Okay, 22, that's enough for five casts of fire. I don't know how much cure costs. I'm pretty sure fire costs four. God, just fucking variety hour with the monsters here. Uh, hit him. Ooh, excuse me. Damn, they're going hog wild. Yeah, I should have stabbed them. Has no items. Did I already steal from him? Oh, of course. I was like, I don't remember selecting him the second time. It's because I didn't select him. He just happened to be the last thing alive. Walking level. Yeah, I guess. Let's 
See if we get into like one more fight before before Vargas. I don't remember if he has like other slunky monks with him or not. I'm not using Bio Blaster. Probably do more damage. One shot these. I guess they already die in one hit. Okay, well, now that we're face to face. Use some of those potions we've been nabbing. Perfect. You know what? Yeah, no, we're, we're, we're stealing so fucking many. Just top everybody up. 17. Oh, there it is. It's like, I can't fucking see how much fire costs. Oh, cure costs even more, so I'll probably just... Stay with fire. Sabin sent you, didn't he? No. Who are you? Sabin, is he here? You were the one sneaking around us the whole way up here, weren't you? And if I was? Hmm. Well, it doesn't really matter who you are. I've got no plans to surrender. Woe is the day you met me. It'll be the last day of your lives. And I'm pretty sure Sabin. Oh yeah, he's, he's got Ipoos. I should be stealing from Vargas and not the Ipoos. Ah, high potion's not bad. Wait, can I not? Hold up. Oh, I can't target him at all. Until these guys are dead. Those bears look ragged enough that they might actually be like poison element and fucking heal from. Uh, Bio Blaster. So, I'm not gonna worry about it. Well, he's done stealing, so... I guess we'll stab? No, nope, never mind. I think I want to save the rest of her magic for healing at this point. Steal from... Steal from the big V-Man. Um, is that all he has? I don't know if enemies can have more than one uh, thing to steal in this game. Come on, what's the matter? Hey, none of those two hits. Yeah. Okay. I'm not sure I can poison him, but I can try. Wait, nope, nope. He had nothing left. Okay, I think we're gonna put a cure on everybody. Send you all to the grid build! Here comes Sabin. It isn't Sabin. Why, Vargas? Why did you kill Master Dungeon? Dungeon? Master Dungeon! Why did you kill Master Duncan? How could you kill your own father? The fool snubbed me, his only son. He chose, he chose you as his successor. That's not true. Our master. It's true and you know it. It's written in that ugly sneer across your face. He wanted you to be his successor, not me. He knew you had the most potential. I'm sick of listening to your lies! I've got far more than just potential. Why don't you see for yourself? A blizzard fizzard! Answer dungeon in the final boss boss final. And Savin like sticks around and puts the smack down on him. I think forward back forward is his flurry fist and quarter circle forward is his uh, beam attack. Ah, Sabin, my father was right to see so much in you. I guess there's no avoiding this. Fate made us train together. Now fate will send you to your doom! Huh. Get ready to join your beloved master. I did it right. <laughs> How much damage does that do? Yeah! Pretty sure that does more than the flurry fist, so we're just gonna keep... Why hold back, Sabin? Time's almost up. Incorrect? Bullshit. Think I don't know how to do a fucking quarter circle forward? It's probably because I didn't do it fast enough. You gotta use the Kamehamehas. Time to put an end to this. I need to use a blitz technique, like the master taught me. Okay. 
Forward, back, forward. That's the shitty one. Finally press the A button. If you make a mistake, nothing will happen. Be careful. Okay, yes. I got it. You didn't need to tell me three fucking times. I've already done two blitzes. Just a flurry rush. What? Okay, maybe I gotta do it faster. I should do it. Forward, back, forward! That's what it was, right? It wasn't back, forward, back. I have 12 health. If they're familiar with the game over screen. That was fucking dumb. That was forward back forward, right? That's what I did. Okay, we can just speed through this shit. Let's kill the Ipoos. Steal from the Ipoos. Okay, let's see if Bioblaster works. Ah, uh, there's no point in saving your MP since you're gonna get kicked out of the fucking fight. Excuse me. Did I steal from the first one or not? I wasn't even paying attention. Fuck, I missed- I missed it there too. Wait, did the Bioblast deal damage? Shit. I'm not paying any fucking attention. Okay. Bioblaster. Damage? Yes, no? i will just keep stealing more. Okay, Bioblaster did damage. Seems to do less damage, though. Yippee, skippy, whippy. Okay, I probably just have to deal enough damage and then I'll start the... Uh, seven will probably come in. It might be a, a number of turns, though, instead. Ah, why did I attack? It's a bottle crossbow. Idiot move. Set the man on fire, please. Okay, yep. Creepy on. Vergus, blah, blah, blah. Seven, happy, five. Okay. What if... I blitz... It just happened to work that time. I think I'm not doing it fast enough. Oh! That's all I had to do! I just had to Raging Fist him first. Just had to fist him. If only you had- wow. I'm sitting here fucking blasting him with Kamehameha's and it's just like... No, you just had to- just had to give him a bit of the shimmy nutsack. And he's like, wait, what the fuck? Brother? Brother? Here is twin brother. His brother. At first I thought you were another one of Vargas' bears. You thought I was a bear? I guess I'll uh, take that as a compliment. Anyway, Edgar, what are you doing here? We're on our way to the Saber Mountains. To the Returner Hideout, no doubt. So the wheels are finally turning. I've been watching from a distance, hoping the world would come to its senses. The way things were going, I was afraid Figaro would end up as a puppet state. Yeah, you just had to you just had to hit him with the furious nutsack. A means of striking back has presented itself. Because it's supposed to be a tutorial for teaching you how to do the blitzes. Never mind the fact that I did a different better blitz already. What, Sabin and Edgar? Well, I mean... Like... All you have to go on is their face, which, like... Is almost identical. 
Sabin's got like that extra little bit of like slightly those two pixels that are slightly lighter, um, which Edgar doesn't have. And I think his eyes are darker. But other than that, it's like their hair color's the same. But like the whole rest of their sprite is their clothes and their hair. So like I don't know, they're wearing different clothes and have different hair. So obviously it's gonna look different. Or do you mean in the portraits? There'll be no more playing Lap Dogs the Empire. I'm through with that act. Think a bear like me could be of any help? You join us, Seven. I think Duncan would rest easier knowing his training helped bring peace to the world. I'm gonna turn my mic up just a bit, so maybe. I'll maybe try not speaking quite so loudly since it's straining on my throat a little bit. Well, then, let's get going. I mean, it's hard to say. It's really hard to say. I guess here, Edgar's hair looks like a whole lot yellower. Uh. -huh. But anyway, uh, we can also put Sabin in the back row because we can just have him keep doing Kamehameha's all day long. Everybody in the back. Hold up, who did we give? Yeah, you can. No. I hit, I hit square to remove it, like this was Final Fantasy VII, but that's just a speed up button, and I was confused. Give him the power. Even though his Kamehameha is based off of his fucking. Hold up. Wasn't the Hyper Risk giving other people 15 power? That's giving him 23 power? I don't know. I think it's dependent. Because that's. 19. That's 18. Okay. It's just dependent on. Uh, what your actual strength stat is. It's a percentage. Yeah, I guess putting that on him doesn't actually help at all. Now that I think about it. So I may as well just remove it. Edgar's literally never gonna attack. I should put the Hermes sandals on Sabin so he can just shit out damage at the cost of no MP. It's kind of too good to be true. Should I go back to that save point and use a tent or something? Maybe, but fuck it. We outie. Sleeping bag on Terra. Have five of them. Two tenths. All right, that green cherry. Never found out what the fuck that does. Cures imp status. Miss Red Machinist is masochist. Ah, I was like, where the fuck does it say machinist? But right there. Magitech Elite Monk. Had the venturer. This bullshit. This regular attack. Now that we got my man. The only thing is he attacks a random target, which is like, eh. Adventure class best class. Hold up. I want to see, because I think he only starts with those two blitzes, but I could be wrong. Oh! Ah! There's the good old suplex. RL down up. I think I'm gonna move these guys around a bit too. There we go. I mean, yeah. Luck is basically like a classic Final Fantasy thief. 
He comes with steel. Okay, so it's RL down up. And I think the problem is, I think you've got to do it fast. Like, you have, like, a whole second to input the input. Which I think was the problem. So I was trying to put it in carefully and not quickly. Sup. King Edgar, this way, please. Ah, but I want to loot the pots. Oh. Well, now I'm going to go back and loot the pots. And the boxes. Yeah, there's, there's nothing in here. Pretty sure this whole place gets set on fire or some shit. It's when we're escaping here that we first meet Ultros. Can I nap? Nope. I can nap in complete strangers' houses, but in, like, my own- in organizations that I'm part of's own secret base. Can't sleep there. The Empire wouldn't even think of looking for our headquarters here. What you got? Don't need it. Nope. I'm not gonna spend money on it. Nope. Nope. We good. Nope. Don't need it. I could probably sell some of this garbage. Actually, um, what is Sabin equipped with, and do I have better armor for him? That's the same. I can't put a buckler on him. Hmm. Can't sleep when enemies are near. I already talked to this fool. This leads out to the back, I think. No. You're gonna make me pay? Oh! He's not gonna make me pay. Reasonable. I guess it's still an inn. Oh, the guy's gone. I guess he got sick of waiting. What do we got? Ooh, save hole. Quick save sparkle. Nothing in any of these bar- Hey, Bannon. I'm just gonna loot your shit real quick. No, I don't actually put this there. Bannon, we brought her with us. Oh, right, I forgot about his gigantic, crazy fucking lion main portrait. Jesus. So this is the girl, the town, whom the Esper- The one to whom the Esper responded. The town? Esper? Carrier pigeons have kept me informed. I also heard that she wiped out 50 Imperial soldiers in mere minutes. No, that's not- Terra. For heaven's sake, Bannon, the girl doesn't remember anything. Hiding from the truth won't change it. Perhaps you've heard the story before. Once when people were still pure and innocent, there was a box they were told never to open. Someone went and opened it anyway, unleashing all the evils of the world. Pride. Envy. Greed. McGriddle. The only thing that remained in the box was a single ray of light. Hope. Yeah, thanks Thanks for the the Greek mythology. Power is a gift, not a curse. No matter what happens, you must remember that. <sighs> Old King Goot. King dude guy. Ban. We are not fighting, father. Grown weary with the hour. Allow me to rest a while. Bitch, we just got here. Got a nap on us. Your boss stole someone important from me. I've hated it ever since. No one stands up to the Empire, more people will be left like me. That's why I joined the Returners. There's no one important in my life. I have no family, no friends. That's not true. And besides, I'm sure there are people who feel you're important to them. Those people are counting on you too. And those people. Okay, this is the same dialogue. Let's rosy mosey on out. 
We're a small organization, but we've been able to synthesize around the world. Freedom is almost within our grasp. Mm. It's not. Spoilers. Bad shit happens. Ooh, air knife. I think that one does full damage from the back row. Knight's code. That's another one that lets you block shit. Oh, I should give that to Savin. That's a uh, yeah. Fuck. Can't even give her the air knife. I've been cheated. Cheated out of my sky blade. Wait, did I go in this door? Yes. In fact, I went out of this door. Phew. How do we get outside to that cliff area? What's up, Sabs? I know that I trust my brother completely. He's always thought of my needs before his own ever since we were little. I think you should trust him too. But don't tell him I said that. He'll turn red as a tomato. Har har har. Farfeldar. Is there an exit down here? I don't think so. Beep. Warp speed walking. It is not a knife made of air. It's an air knife. Hey, hey, hey. It's not easy asking so much of you. If we force our ideas on you, we're no different from the Empire. So we want you to decide for yourself. Okay. Because I know she has like a one-on-one -on -one conversation with Bannon out on a cliff. I can go back to Locke and I talk and I'm like, I will join you. Or something. Where's the big bean man? Oh, he went outside just a moment ago. Ah, here we go. Yeah, there's... The game doesn't really have a main character. Have you made your decision? Will you become our last ray of hope? I think if you say no, you just like... You just gotta come back and t say yes eventually. I see. Oh, yeah, it doesn't let you... Ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, fuck that. Anyway, yeah, that you, you can't progress. You basically just gotta come back here and say yes. I'm scared. The uncertainty you're feeling is only natural. Tara, I want you to have this. What is it? Charm to help keep you safe. Take it. Gauntlet! I have a plan. Would you please gather everyone together? Around the war table. Fuck this table over on the right is just like embedded into the rock. We all know the Gestalian Empire is using its magic power to wage war. Question is, where did they get that power? I had Locke dig around for information. It seems the Empire has been gathering scholars from around the world to study espers. Narsha's esper was also the reason for the Imperial assault there. Are you saying there's some kind of connection between espers and magitech? Espers and magitech. Only one possible link comes to mind. You don't mean... The War of the Magi. R impossible! Rabble, rabble, rabble. Rabble, rabble, rabble. My grandma used to tell me bedtime stories about magic machines. Those stories were true? You're saying we're on the verge of a second War of the Magi? It's only a guess. The war took place a thousand years ago, and every historian has a different theory. But one theory says that energy drained from Esperus was used to power machines, that ordinary humans were also infused with that same energy. So that's what Magitek power is. If we're going to fight Magitek enemies, we need Magitek weapons of our own. No! That would bring about another War of the Magi! Then what do you propose? I was wondering if we might not be able to have a chat with an Esper. With an Esper? It's risky, but that Esper reacted to Terra before. If we could get it react to her again, we might just be able to wake it up. Do you really think that would work? All stories are true, boy. I can't say for sure, but I believe it is our best shot. Of course, we can't do anything without Terra's help. Terra. I'll do it! 
Not entirely sure I understand the plan, but what the hey? Sounds like it'll be fun. What was that? That noise just now. You been infiltrated. Oh, he like drops a bomb? Or no, 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 this is a guy that uh, comes comes back for a report. Because he's like, well, they're on their way. They're in South Figaro. Ah, that was right. So South Figaro. What's wrong? What happened? The, the Empire's taken South Figaro. They're headed this way. So they found us. We haven't a moment to lose. Lock. I know. Someone has to sneak into South Figaro to slow down the enemy, right? This is right up your alley. We're counting on you. Okay, I think this is the cider part. Wait for me. I won't be gone long. And watch out for a certain lecherous young king who shall remain nameless. The guy moves in like a hawk. He's getting all huffy. Old habits die hard, eh? What about us? He dies like Padme. We can escape down the Leith River and make our way to Narsh. I'm curious about that esper they found in the mines. Very well, be ready to... I'll ready the raft at the back entrance. It's risky, but we don't have much of a chance at this point. Much of a choice. It's not safe here, come with us to Narsh. I'm sure they'll just welcome us right back in. Could be a chance for you to gain a better standing understanding of your abilities. We've no time to dilly-dally. Let's make for Narsh. Scraw sex. That fucking 30 second like delay from Twitch. Like it took me a split second for me like, what the fuck is he typing? And it's like, oh I get it, the swoop in like a hot comment. Here we go! The ref will carry us to Narsh! Yippee skippy whippy! Head towards Nar- heading- Head towards Narsh while protecting Bannon at all costs. If Bannon falls in battle, the journey's over! Can I pause? Nope. I cannot change equipment here. Oh shit, and I can actually steer. I don't know why I targeted this one. Nope. Uh, Prey? Okay, well he's real dead. Fuck, right, I gotta do the suplex. I gotta try it. I think that just gives everybody a little bit of health for free. Fuck! It's a lot of health for free. Bullshit! I inputted the shit out of that command. Uh, yeah. I can see when it pops up. Um, I'm not sure any of this actually matters. I, I, I think you can get, like, like those two paths just reconverged. Fuck. Shit. Ah, I fucked that one up. We are not getting a suplex. Wait until the Phantom Train. But I gotta know, I gotta make sure I'm doing it right. Uh, I think that was too slow. Fuck. Those opposites are like hard to do really fast without accidentally getting a diagonal in there. Yeah, that bioblast is not doing a lot of damage. Come on. Yeah! Slam! That Nautiloid. Fuck, that does a lot of damage, too. Yeah, you gotta, like, strike a bargain between going fast and doing it very precisely. Wow, yeah, it doesn't let me just roll my hand across the way I normally would. Try, try doing that one a little slower. Yeah, there we go. 
when you start playing fighting, you're just like, you just like pound out that fucking quarter circle. Yeah, it'll register it. Bannon, why the fuck are you in the front? No, I can't change it. Well, I can use the row command. Which I should probably do before Ultra, since that is a legit boss fight. Down the river! Rolling down the hole, as they say. Shoot everyone in the face. Go to the back. Oh, Terra's blinded. How dare you? Who did that? Ah! That asshole. Okay. Yeah, I don't know why that the Raging Fist always just looked like a series of nut sacks. Can't LOL those inputs? What do you mean? You also put the L's in caps, which makes me think exclusively of League of Legends. So, I have no idea what the fuck you're talking about. Excuse me? Oh shit, she's still blinded. Eh, yeah, may as well. May as well fix it. Eye drops. Oh, I was almost like, gold needle, we'll just... We'll just poke the blindness out. How is Bannon only at two-thirds health when he's prayed every fucking turn he's had? Wait, 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 hold up. No, 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 no. Stay in the back. We can change equipment and relics. Yeah, plume tat. Didn't I get something else for someone else? I cannot take Bannon's stuff. Oh, I got a relic. I got a gauntlet? Uh, allows one weapon to be held with both hands. Eh. Don't really need that at the moment. I'd rather have the shields on everybody. Just leave the only girl in the party blind around a cave on a raft. No biggie. I mean, we're gonna get out of this cave real quick. In fact, right now. Just like that. To the left, to the left? Now nah, we're going up. Like, I think you get slightly different battles, but I don't think any of it actually matters. Mm. Oh, that, that's still registered. I kind of I kind of janked it up a little bit. Is Prey not hitting Bannon? Is Prey hitting everyone but Bannon? This, the microphone's like blocking the very right hand chunk. What? Nope. No, it's hitting Bannon. Did not mean to change your row. I meant to blitz. Visual logistics of changing a bunch of equipment that wouldn't match at all is amusing. Just the river of stupid fucking pointless ass fights. This is a bit of a not great segment, not gonna lie. I much prefer the, the underground river as opposed to the overground river. That part actually has tough fucking fights in it, if I recall right. It's been a while. I did that aura can a little fast. Still worked. Still worked. Just, just go right up. Fucking. I was gonna say fish just like Goku does, but I'm like, no, Goku doesn't blast Kamehameha's into the fucking river. He just gets down there and grabs the fish with his bare ass hands. Should be suplexing fish. Catch fish like Goku. Suplex him right out of the river. We're gonna try it. Fuck. I fucked it up. Nope, I fucked it up. I might have fucked it up. I did not. Are you gonna suplex? Yeah! I guess neither of them are fish. I guess one's a crustacean and the other's uh... What do you call it? Not a nautilus. I mean, it technically is, but there's a, there's a different name. There's a different name for it. That is slipping my mind. Fuck! 
That's a loop. That's a loop. We went in a loop. And now we're going in a loop again. Damn it. Well, now we know. Did that do less damage? Oh, whatever. He, he's dead now. They tricked ya! They did. Stop hitting my dudes. Yeah, fuck that one up. Uh, oh, Bannon gained the level. Yippee, skippy, whippy. Fucking a light with excitement. Excite brightment. Fucking suplex these bitches. Stop. Well, I guess I really. Oh, come on. That was a perfect suplex. I really don't care if Bannon's blind. Maybe he does, like, outrageous physical damage, and I just don't know. Okay, that that should be a that should be a suplex. Bullshit. Bullshit. Nope. Okay, did I get that fast enough? Fucking finally. Suplex them. I mean I'm suplexing them into the surface of the water, so like. I don't feel like that would do very much. You just kind of like get a splash. Get a splash on. Yeah, smash him. Smash him into the river, baby. Make him eat shit. Oh, I thought that was a failed one for a second. I was like, are you fucking joking me? That was like a picture perfect. Kamehameha. Man, too cool for the shit. Yeah, with his fucking shades. He just keeps the party healed as fuck. Healed AF. Not like Dragon Ball AF. Yeah, if you get, but he doesn't look like he's going that fast, and he's not taking very long. Left. When I said to the left, to the left, I should have listened. Oh well. I mean, we're all at full fucking health because of Bannon. Cool guy Bannon. Bannon the cannon. That's what they called him back in his high school wrestling days. No! Blitz! Oh shit, I just attacked with Bannon. Bannon confirmed Strider. Well, he missed anyway because he's too fucking blind. There we go. Yep. Good, good. Hit the one who hasn't been hit yet. Shit, I just attacked with Bannon again. He likes the back row, ironically. Edgar gained a level. Another cave. Another save. Another cave, another save. You can stay blind, old man. Fuck him. Alright. Let's continue the journey. I probably should have refilled my water. Yeah, we're about halfway through the stream. Probably should have. Well, yeah, will we stream longer? I don't know. We'll see how I feel it too. Mm, that was pretty fast. That might not come out. Yep. See, if this were actually Street Fighter, it wouldn't be nearly so finicky about it. Nah, 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 nah. You can put that command too damn fast. There aren't many people who have the execution skills to input fucking Street Fighter commands too fast. Uh, like, if you're talking about a combo, then you gotta get timing right. And you can't put shit in too early, but like, doing the inputs to a quarter circle too fast is like, hard to do consistently. Okay, this is the final chunk. Maybe this is not the final chunk. I'm pretty sure we fight Ultras while we're going de- Oh, I remember now. No, there's like a series of other fights, and like without actually exiting the fight screen, uh, Ultras just like shows up during the fight with like some piranha fish things. It's like we're going down a waterfall when that happens, if I recall. 
Might have been a fucked up. Come on, come on. Nope. Pray, Bannon. Pray like your life depends on it, because it technically does. At least, kind of. Heals almost his full fucking head. Oops. Hit A too many times and just didn't even input anything. Drain! Two lines of Eldritch bullshit. Hey, what do we got here? Gwee! <laughs> You're up the creek without a paddle. And I'm gonna let you through. I'm not gonna let you through. Does that make me a bad octopus? Hey. Isn't he weak to fire? Wasn't that the thing? Like, it cooked him real bad? Yeah. Seafood soup is not on the menu. Ow. I'm afraid seafood soup is on the menu. Damn, we are fucking annihilating this octopus. That's when the tasty. What? Oh, I'd love to get my. Right, he's talking about it. Terra. Fucking text is going too fast! Fuck 102 damage. Bannon, fix the problem. <laughs> now they're both too fucking cool for school. Now, is that Inca an auto response? Yeah, it is. He countered, he counters fire magic, or fire damage, with ink. I'm pretty sure I can suplex Ultros. There's some characters you can't suplex, because they're like, embedded in the ground. Muscleheads, hate him! Okay, so he like, makes a comment first before he hits whoever he's gonna hit. Y'all know it's time to pay attention- hold up. I can't- I, I can't read the fucking chat while this shit's happening. Oh, okay, yeah, so you, you cannot suplex Ultras, because he's like, embedded in the ground, even though it's water. But whatever. It's a good thing Bannon's here, because holy fuck, his Ultra's, like, giving me the business. I don't care if you keep blinding Terra, because she's just gonna keep shooting me at Jik. Bioblaster might actually be able to poison him, but I don't remember, and I don't care to try. Wish Locke were here to steal something from him. And now he's gonna become a bunch of tentacles, maybe? Guess it got the point. Or he's gonna throw us over the waterfall? Something. It's time to pay attention when there's actual dialogue scripted into the fight. Suplex every dillweed. Nope, no grinding. I'm part of the boss fights now. Yeah. No, it's just because I know how to fucking do Seven's input commands, and I'm also playing... Uh -huh. Well, yeah. I'm also playing on G G GBA version instead of SNES. Because uh, the SNES was even more strict. Like, it was really fucking finicky. It's probably just hiding down there. Ew. Something stuck to my leg. Get away from there. We should be alright now. Eight armed freak, I'm gonna smash it with a blitz. No, Seven! Out of my way, Edgar. Oh, fuck. <laughs> well, he's always been a bit rash. Yes. Fight an octopi. Seven. Oh, he'll be fine. Are you sure, Bannon? Sir? You're his brother. You should know better than any of us. Any second now, he'll flop back up onto the raft, right as rain. Whoa! I think you missed the onto the raft part. Seven! You're on your own now. He got, he got swung. Yeah, he goes a different way. It's what, Seven, Cyan, and Shadow? Who end up together? Edgar and Terra race towards Narsh while protecting Bannon. But what of Sabin, who was swept away by the raging waters? And how is Locke faring after having penetrated the Empire's defenses in South Figaro? Is all going according to plan? Time for hentai. Yeah, no man, he just jumps right in. Like I said, same way Goku fishes. You just get in and pound the shit out of that fish. Choose a scenario, Koopa. I think we'll do Locke first. Uh... Oh fuck, it's actually Mog, and not just some random moogle. Yeah, let's do Locke's scenario. I think it's pretty quick. Locke has worked hard to stymie the efforts of the Imperial troops in South Figaro, but now he desperately needs to escape.
Yeah, how, how Ultros, like, ends up at the fucking Ultra House, I have Ultra? Opera House? I have no idea. Pretty ballsy move. Yeah, I mean, they had to do something different. Gotta get to Nurse on the fly! Marty McFly! Hey, you there. What are you doing here? Scram! Okay. I thought maybe we'd start a fight or some shit. Oh! Did I miss Duncan's house last time? Rich people's homes always have secret passages. You just have to search until you find a place where you can feel a draft. Okay. That's obviously a fucking clue. Yes, have a point. Out of the way, Mog. Hold on, do I have any better equipment on- oh. Ah, he can equip the air knife. Life can be with the power of wind. I guess he should be in the front row since, uh, I have no other damage sources right now. And I can just, like, suck back potions. Suck potions like eggs. I just had some eggs. They were pretty good. We'll ignore that, man. Where do I get the stinking cider? This man needs the cider. Bring me some cider and maybe I'll talk to you. Yeah, he's he's got a, uh... He's, like, working with the returns or some shit, but cider's, like, the secret, like... Tip-off. My grandpa used to be a servant for the richest family in town. But he said I'm only supposed to let merchants through here now. Gotcha. And that wife has been in multiple affairs with rich people. It does still matter. At least I'm pretty sure. Some Final Fantasies it does, some Final Fantasies it doesn't. Hello. Oh, you sell the cider! I think. Now that was just plain rude, I'm a treasure hunter. Don't you forget- Oh, what? Hey, quit being a dick. <laughs> Got your hat, asshole. Stole his clothes, too. Right, right. And now I dress up like a merchant. Yes. They're a little tight, but the price was right. Wuh. Whew. Whew? Whew? Doesn't seem like an appropriate response, but sure. He's still in his clothes. Why do I always have to go and open my mouth? Oh, so we started that fight, not, uh, not him. He was like, aren't you that thief? And we were like, hey, motherfucker. <laughs> yes, yes, in fact, we are. Now we're going to steal your fucking clothes. Okay, there's no cider here. Do you sell cider? Those armored soldiers, they'll kill you for talking to them. Yeah, I'm pretty sure if you talk to the Magitek, you get in a fight with the Magitek armor, and they have, like, all the same moves that they did before, so they just, like laser blast your face off for 300 damage. Nah, 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 nah. You're a merchant, right? Okay, you go ahead. Pretty sure I looted this. We're back in the car cat room. Without, without all the fucking bike horns on the stairs. Oh, did it go from merchant to birthday suit? I didn't even see that. Where do I get the cider? He's not in his suit, but I'd rather not chance it. One would assume at the pub. Le pub. Is this a soldier? Ooh, 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 ooh. Fuck. Ah! Went the wrong ass way. Damn, he's just love the way he's pumping those arms. Ah! Hmm. Where are you, El Pube? Ah, aha, uh ah, -huh, ah, uh -huh, it, aha, uh -huh, there's a bridge back there. That's the secret bit. Back to the pube. Avoid the noise. Shit, 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 shit. I got it. Nope. 
Come here. What? Really? Hold, hold up, hold up, hold up. Does this man have the cider? Give me the cider. You came to steal my cider, did you? You dirty little thief! Stole your fucking hat again. Stole his clothes too! Here we go! That's the same shit. Yeah, <laughs> there it is, birthday suit. The sneaky ducks with their sneaky bridges. I don't think ducks need bridges. Okay. Now, I seem to remember there being some sort of timing element to this, but I might be wrong. I might just have to get there. It's in the back of this house. Out of the way, my child! Well, I guess you're not my child, but... Fucking move. Let's roll on through. Here's your cider, man. Secret passage? Well, yes, there's a tunnel. <laughs> From here to the mansion on the north end of town. Go downstairs and tell my grandson the password. It's, um, I forget. And that's the trick. The password is I forget. Password is? Or wait. No, I thought... Eh. Okay, we were supposed to find it in a book or something, but whatever. I must have been thinking of something else. Roll on over. What the fuck are those those gears with the buckets? I guess they're probably putting the water into like something in the building that's next to them. You just, you just can't see it. <sighs> Must acquire loot. Yeah, now let's turn the clock. Uh, now what? Oh, here we are. I still don't know how I'm supposed to actually leave. Imperial troops have turned this house into their headquarters. Okay. Oh, there's that room with the draft. It's really off of your little secret password guard kid person. Hold up. I'll, I'll talk to him just to see if he says anything. I betrayed the town to the Empire. All I could think of was the money. It's a weird janky watermill. Not really, because that's not, that doesn't work at all as a water mill. Because that was one, that was like the top gear, so the buckets were moving like this, and then around. So there's no way the water would push those. Because they're, like the direction of their movement, it would be completely perpendicular to the direction of, like the water would have to be motionless in the channel and fucking spinning sideways for that to be a water mill. Hmm. Remove the disguise. His clothes are fine. I think someone's gonna be like, there's the guy who stole my clothes. I know I've seen her. Oh, Celeste's in there. Or Celly's. I think it's Celly's. This is what happens to traitors. Magitech Knight, forged by the Empire and tempered in battle. None have ever truly known the woman beneath the General's guise. Yeah, Sellies. Overthinking SNES graphics? Nah, man. What else is there in life? What overthinking SNES graphics? So the mighty Sellies has fallen. Why don't you just, like, turn these dudes into ash? Not as far as those who'd use their strength to oppress the weak. Quiet! Kefka's planning on poisoning every last man, woman, and child in the kingdom of Doma. Shut up. Run that mouth of yours while you still can. Your execution's tomorrow. Keep a close eye on her. Yes, sir, I can stay on guard for days without sleep. Right. So, it's not... As soon as we get out of here, the scenario's not over. We gotta take Silly's back out through the cave that we got here in because there's a boss fight there and then 
we make our way back to Narsh. But uh, yeah, Selly's like she's got good magic stats, and she's basically tied with Terra for the best fucking equipment options in the game. But her runic ability is like pretty bad. There are a couple boss fights where it's really useful, and in the rest of the game, you basically never ever want to use it. Hold up. Can I not? Can we turn off auto run to try and sneak here real quick? Her hands are bound. <laughs> Just keep looking. Remove her bindings. What could you possibly hope to pedal in a place like this? I forgot I was still wearing these clothes. Name's Locke. I'm with the Returners. You're a Returner? I'm, or at least I was, General Sellies. Now I'm nothing but a traitor. Well, let's get going. You'd take me with you? No, I can barely walk. I'd never make it out of here. Let's have some potions. I appreciate it, but even if you got me out, you wouldn't be able to protect me. I'm better off waiting for that ex- for the Executioner. At least that way I'll keep my pride. I'll protect you! Trust me, you'll be fine. Wink. Let's go. Wait. The soldier might have something on him that could help us get out of here. Whoa. There's a clock key. The clock that was working and the clock that wasn't working. Stealing is wrong. Yeah, now we taking that key. Oh, fuck. Oh, right. I think he's, like, still asleep. More soup and... Oh, my boy. We'll just silently slip on out. Okay, let's turn that auto dash back on. We probably didn't need to turn it off, but it's better safe than sorry. What do you got there? Ooh, nothing. Let's change that. Hold up. The relics. Yeah. Yeah. She's gonna rag house. Cause I mean, like, what does she know? Like, fucking ice and cure or some shit? Yeah. Oh, that was a guess, too. It's like, yeah, they're good. But. She, she has more health than fucking Locke does. Uh, I'll probably still keep Locke in the front row just cause. Nah, fuck it. Thieving all the way. Oh, I should probably swap what order they're in. So, Celeste's the fighter now. The fucking... Mystic Knight. Although she doesn't actually know Spellblade, so... She's got Runic, which is a hell of a lot less useful than Spellblade. Okay, so one of these clocks... Okay, so that one is ticking. This one is get get over here. Get this one is not ticking. Wind it. What did we open? Where do we open? Was it out here? Get around this garbage, please. Thank you. Uh, woo, excuse me. I don't see anything. Wait, there's a secret way back through the back. Okay, was there? Did something open in this room and I just not notice it? Oh, fuck, there's a door here. Didn't notice it. And we battling. Vector Hound. Under 30 damage, not bad, not bad. Ouch. Ow, my bones. I can heal all that up with a potion. I guess I'll just have Locke start hitting now. Whatever. Stole two potions, use one. Oh fuck. She actually got the shit beat out of her. Huh. Yeah, fuck it. Go in the back. Take the gauntlet off. 
future silver spectacles. You know what? I should put those on lock just because he has no damage outside of attacking. No, don't remove. Add! He's got a shield, right? Yeah. And yeah. Alright, we all good. Alright, I still need to heal her. No, oh, good enough. Now, is there treasure? Ooh. We got a bit of a maze on our hands. Well, hey there, commanders. How's it going? Freeze them up. Mm. I like the effect on that. The animation. More blizzards if you would. More thiefing. Will that kill him? Yep. <sighs> Are there any trap floors here? Because that would piss me off. Ooh, you can probably wield that. You can probably wield both of those. Yeah. Or she could be even stronger if I do land it. You know, I should probably give the hyper wrist to Locke too. Or no, wait, what the fuck else is he wearing? Nothing. Because again, he has no alternative damage whatsoever. So I may as well make him as good as possible at the only thing he can do, damage-wise. Probably should have used some of those potions to heal up Sally's, but... Damn it! Hit down to select the other fucking Vector Hound. I guess I need to hit... Nope. Left. There we go. Take the power from the doggo. God, they have blood red eyes. It's a little terrifying. Well, at this point, we can just wail on them. Now that we've filched them dry. Fucking. What am I doing? Potions. Yeah, fuck it. I still have more potions than I started with. I think I started this section with 28. Now I've got 35. Uh, use the boost button. Use the boost to get through. Blizzard costs more than fire does. Fire only costs 4 MP. It seems to do less damage to you, but though maybe these guys have, uh, whoop, fuck. Maybe these guys have higher. Oh, turns out I failed the first time anyway. Nope. Maybe these guys have higher magic defense. Third time's the charm. Just lead him to an icy grave. Okay, so the stairway's there. Is that a stairway to treasure? I don't remember. Monster in a box? No. I thought it was gonna be. Boost the strength of the wearer's magic. Effect increases when worn in pairs. Yeah, I remember this being like really good early game relic. Because, well, you've got magic on fucking everybody in this game. That is just a mysterious hole. So we got three sets of stairs. Uh, I guess it doesn't matter. I should say I should steal from the commander in the back since he seems to die first, but they all just have potions anyway, so What fucking difference does it make? The answer is absolutely no What are you doing giving doggos potions? Seems irresponsible. It's probably not good for them 
Don't do potions, kids. Not even once. Yeah, slurp back. Delicious pots. What's up? Staircase number one. The exit. That's the exit. I think the staircase down there is a red herring. How do I get over here? I think that might lead to treasure. They might both be red herrings. Or maybe some other colored herrings, but... I don't know. I'm not sure I've ever had herring. Although I'm not a big fan of fish as it is. Pretty much the only non-shellfish fish that I actually like is my dad's uh, deep-fried halibut. Everything else is just like... Yeah, yeah. Don't like salmon, don't like trout, don't like tuna. I really don't like tuna. The fucking smell of canned tuna makes me yak. Oh, I did find a different way up and up. Ooh, iron armor. Oh yeah, didn't we get a better shield? Oh, it's already on her. Uh, you can probably put on the iron armor. Lower speed, but more defense, more magic defense. Good, good, good. You're the one with the heal spells, so... You're the one with the, uh... What's that? I, I think those stairways are just red herrings. I don't think they go way anywhere. Or come from anywhere. There's mysterious basement stairs. Built by who knows who. For who knows why. Encase them in icy doom! Hmm, I don't want icy squares. I haven't had an icy square in a long time. I think it was like last year or the year before that I learned that like... It says right on them, icy squares are not chocolate. It says right on them that they're like a chocolate flavored confection. It's like... They're like some kind of oil based... Like some kind of solid edible oil that's chocolate flavored. This is like, meh. That's why they have the texture they do that you don't like find on any actual chocolate. Cause they ain't chocolate. They're chocolate flavored. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. They're still delish, but they're probably not very good for you. Don't think we're stealing quite as many potions as I think we are. Fuck, she's almost at MP. Well, I mean, she's still got a good chunk, but... I mean, we're slowly losing. When I said we started at 28, it might have been 38. Shit, where the fuck did I come from? Aha! Figured it out. At least I think I did. Maybe this is another new area. I don't know. We'll find out. Uno momento. Whoops. Accidentally blizzarded one. Well, that'll probably kill it. Which is fine. It's two blizzards killed them anyway. And in fact, they flee. I get less XP, steal fewer potions, less money, so... Hold up. Now I'm not sure. I, I think I know where I am. Yeah, yeah. Two blizzards will kill all of them, so there's no point in blizzarding them individually. Good, good, good. Fuck! Oh, wait. I didn't get it last time. Good. Good. Let's finish him. Go ahead, me. One, two, one, seven. How much fucking money do I have now? Oh, wait. I looked at the steps, not gill. Ah! 16 times. Not bad. Yeah, let's just... Get up there! Get up those damn stairs! Steal that damn potion! Freeze these damn commanders! Whatever you got to do! Just 
fucking recoiling in pain. How many times have they fucking knifed us in the face? They're huge! Why are they so big? I don't know. I don't care. They're dead now. Now they're just big corpses. Filling huge graves. Why are you helping me? You remind me a lot of someone. What's the matter anyway? I'm helping you because I want to. Whee! And we outie. Oh. Right. I have to keep going. Um, uh, hmm. I'm gonna do like one more fight before I need a uh, sleeping bag. Although, there's the healing spring in here, but I don't remember if we fight the boss before or after that. Yeah, I'm not doing a back attack. I don't care if you guys are dick easy, but. We're mm -mm. rolling out. Mmm, baby. Delicious bacon. Which I also just ate earlier. I'm already kind of hungry again. It's a good dungeon theme. Hold up, these aren't the same enemies. These are palette swaps. I think. Are those two acrophils? Are they, are they the same color? They look slightly different colors. No, don't numb claw me. He numb clawed me. Does that slow me down or some shit? In fact, that ATB bar looks completely immobile. Yeah, he's glowing like a weird purple instead of just the red from haste. I don't think that carries over. Nope. Should probably just go back out and sleep in a bag. As they did back in the old days. I can probably, yeah, cast one cure on the both of us. I could have just cast it all on lock. I'm gonna give her a sleeping bag anyway. She's gonna be at full health anyway. Hmm. Whatever. Now we're more than good. I'm pretty sure I fight some kind of mechanized, like, drill or digger. Some sort of, like, pummeler. I don't know, something. Get out of my way. Move, bitch. Get out the way. Come on. All these flat ass manta fuckers. How do you, how did, how did I get how did I come across these guys and not just like be like, alright, well, we're just gonna leave because you're a manta ray in a cave on flat ground? Like how is this thing a threat to me at all? Can't I just like fuck off because it's just kinda like stuck there? Maybe it can kinda like shimmy at me, but I should be able to just Get the fuck out. I don't remember the fucking wave noise last time we were here. Is that turtle moved yet? No. Okay, well it looks like I probably didn't need to use the sleeping bag. Because there's the healing screen right there. Damn, man. Can't nab a damn thing. Can't nab a damn hand. I have a stood behind the camera. Now we're like poorly quoting fucking epic rack battles of history. Okay, so that noise wasn't waves. That was, yeah, it was something like tunneling or something. Something's coming! Through the wall! Yeah, tunnel armor. TUNNEL ARMOR! That thing hits us with its magic. They'll be scrubbing two big scorch marks off the wall. So what are we supposed to do? Don't worry. I brought some magic with my runic blade! And you'll be okay. Just watch. 
See, the problem with Runic is it works on the next spell cast. Ooh, air knife. So, you can cancel out your own fucking spells with it. Which is a pain in the fucking ass. Oh wow, I think the air knife does hit from full damage from the back row. 101 from back row is pretty good. Oh, I should check to see if he has multiple items to steal. Yeah, bitch, you ain't got shit. Yeah, let's see if he's got multiple items. Or if enemies can even have multiple items in this game. I'm not sure they can. No, don't drill. I don't like my body. Fuck, why are they stealing? I need to hit him. Mmm. I see. So if I runic one turn, and then he doesn't cast, then I attack the next turn. Yeah, the runic's over. It only lasts till my next turn. Stop stealing. Stop stealing, Locke. And start swinging. With your air knife. It's a pretty good knife. Yeah. I mean, she's like slowly healing herself for free. It's not great, but... Stop hitting my man. The main man, Loke. Loke. Fuck, I did it again. It's just like force of habit, just like, whoop, steal, whoop, go down, steal, whoop, whoop, go down, once hit runic. Ooh. Bitch him. Give him the potion. It does exactly 50, right? It's not like 50 plus a percentage of your health or some shit. Nope. He seems just ever so slightly slower than Tellies. Hmm, yeah. Not quite. Maybe they're about the same speed. I was gonna say, so if I could get the timing right, like I might be able to squeeze an attack in from her. But... We can just keep going like this. It's no... Big problem. I don't know how much health this guy has. How much health did Ultros have? He had a couple hundred at least. In fact, I think he probably had over a thousand. I hit him with I hit him with fire like four or five times. And then, you know, well, I failed the suplex, but uh, you know, I fucking blasted Kawaihawehaz into his face. With no end. Come on. Just kill the fucker. Cause how much was she doing from the front row with the great sword, the gauntlet, and the hyper wrist? It was it was like 180 or something, right? Fuck me. I don't I'm I'm being an idiot. This is I've stolen like four extra times than I needed to. Please just die. I wish I could silence the damn thing. And just wail on it with both party members. <laughs> the dribble is just like a needle right in the fucking eye. It's our gold needle strats all over again. I think... I think I'm just gonna potion as soon as somebody hits under, under 50 health. Or close to 50. Nope. Ruin it, please. Because otherwise, it's just like not really worth it. They're not at risk of dying. Uh, yeah, I'll potion that. Would you cast a fucking spell into her sword, please? Maybe he's just done with spells. Just fucking hit him. Yeah. Air Knife seems to do more damage than her sword, even though her sword's bigger and better. Oh wait, I gave the Hyper Wrist to him, didn't I? That might be why. Hey. Two fifty gil. Woo! Looks like we're finally clear. No, go back and heal at the Turtle Pond. The Turtle Pond. Oh fuck. Choose a scenario, Koopo. He's in a different slot. Wasn't he in the second slot last time? 
That's weird. We're gonna save Seb and shit for last, because we're probably only streaming for another 18 minutes or so, and I want to do that whole bit in one go. Fleeing the Empire's troops, Ben and Edgar and Terra ride the rapids towards Narsh, but the going won't be easy. This is the part where we're on the waterfall. didn't do something fucking stupid like put us in the front row or some garbage did it. It doesn't look like it. And pray. And pray. One fire and one auto crossbow should probably do it anyway. Hmm, apparently not. Yeah, I don't- I think it's just the river section. Oh, wait, did she get hit but take no damage? Oh, some sort of not quite poison, but damage over time thing. Whatever. I ended up doing four damage, so. Not a biggie. Her hair is not quite the same color as the river, but not too far off. Through the mouth of a cave. Oh! I must be thinking of a completely different part then. I could have sworn there's a part where you're like going down a waterfall and a bunch of fish keep coming at you. This does not require anything but. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, there's Narsh. I don't think we do the big part where we're like fighting Kefka and dealing with all those dudes until everybody's reunited. You, you're that Imperial officer from before. And Bannon's like, chill your shit. Please, I can explain. Oh, right, they're not part of the returners, that's the issue. Get out of here now, or you'll regret it. Oh, fuck. Damn. Laid a smackdown on Bannon. Let's not get hasty here. I mean, I think it's a little late. They fucking launched him 15 feet. Liar. Damn. My goodness. Now, my friends, is why I can't stand Bannon. It's like they don't even have yours. <sighs> I'm sorry, it's all my fault. Yeah, there's like some back way into Narsh. Well, it's the same way we got it out of Narsh, isn't it? Yeah, it's like right. When Lock first rescued me, we came out of the mines right around here. He fiddled with something. Gross. Yes, he told me. Twist the stone like so, and... Presto. Presto Bismol. Presto Gizmo. Yeah, that, I think, just opens the thing. Eh. Well, I'm just gonna hold down the X button and the square button. Because these enemies are beneath me. You know what? Fuck it, we're in the front right now. Eat shit. Ooh! Bandage damage is not bad. It's not great, but it's not bad. Okay, I didn't get to actually walk around this section before I don't think. Hold up. I don't think there's any random battles out here, so I kind of want to explore. Can I not go on the roof? Fuck. That's lame. That would have been kind of cool. So there's a cave there, and then there's a bridge. What cave is this? I have no memory of this place. Okay, these are the same assholes. Oh, they're not the same assholes. They have the same sprites. But I think maybe a slightly different palette? Am I supposed to be in this cave? Oh. Ah, this bullshit. Maybe I got that? What place? There's a room in here that used to test applicants to the city guard. We should be fine as long as we follow the light. If we make a mistake, lights will surround us. Then we'll have to tag the glimmering orange light to proceed. Alright, well, I think I already forgot half of the fucking path. It was like... Up and... 
Okay. And down through here. Alright, well, that was simpler than I thought it was gonna be. Weird. Just a weird bit of gameplay, but whatever. It was short. More battles! The rats never stop. Let's, uh, let's just pray a bit. Get our health back up. Taking a few nicks. Damn right you're gonna die. Okay, no, these, these appear to be like the same fucking stupid shitty monsters. Uh... Oh! Okay. Yeah, I know where we are. I think that's a safe hole up there. Okay, so we can just hold this shit down. Hey, what is this? Maybe not? Hey, this is this bit. Is this where I want to go? Maybe? It's got Moogle music, so probably. Oh, I gotta find the one that's actually Mog. I think. I think. And get him to help us. Maybe? Maybe I just ignore him, them entirely and just go in this hole. Let's see where it takes us. Takes us to Treasure. Rune Blade. Rune Blade. Rune Blade. Draws MP from its wielder to deal critical hits. I remember this thing like hitting like a truck, but yeah, it chews through your MP. Nobody else in the party even has MP. Ah, fuck it. To the front with ya. You fighting now. Hmm. Oh wow, it actually increases her defense. Her evasion will go down. What was her evasion beforehand? Oh, okay, her defense did not go up. It went down. And magic defense and evasion, but yeah, whatever. I want someone who's a fucking beat stick. I guess Edgar's like a multi-arrow beat stick man. I wonder if I could just give him the room blade. Probably can't. Oh fuck, is it gonna take MP like every time I attack one of these assholes? Even for fights that don't fucking matter? Mm. On second thought. Back to the, uh, back to the old... Can I have another thing to give her? No. Get out of here. No, 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 no. You fucking re-optimized into the rune blade. Whatever. We'll go with the tried and true method. Oh, that just like led me around. Back to what I know what it been. Throw a fucking wrench at me. What a prickle. Get out of here, Mog. We banning now. Banning the cannon. Just keep doing it. Yep, I don't care about your wrenches. I'm too strong. You throw wrench at my face, I eat it. Okay, so this is a different bridge. So there was another bridge back up there. That I could have gone across. I didn't? Maybe I should have? Well, things are happening, so. Arvis? His name is Arvis. I'm thinking Arvis. King Edgar. Oh, and Terra, too. Arvis, how did things stand here in Narsh? Same as always, the town's neutral. I've tried to convince them to side with the returns, but it's no use. Maybe with you and the King of Figaro here. 
Yeah, the guards weren't uh, too keen on that. But the townspeople. Everyone's been a little on edge since the Esper was discovered. Yeah, that means the Empire's coming to stop your shit. The fuck? Got real intense glare going on. We believe Terra may be able to get us... Help us get answers to our questions about the Esper. The townspeople are still quite curious about it as well. If you approach them the right way, there's a good chance they'll agree to let her see it. That Esper is either going to save us or dig us an early grave. Maybe both. Choose a scenario, Koopo. Okay. And I think we will leave- yeah, now he's at, now he's at the top. Can I, like... I can. Oh. Okay. Second row now. Yeah, I think we will call it there for tonight. And next time we go suplex a train. And, like, watch Doma get completely poisoned and quick save- or quick load. Quick save after every fight and quick load. Every time Shadow leaves the fucking party after a battle. Because he's a 1 in 8 chance per fight. And I think you can get him before you get Cyan. So, like, taking him all the way to Doma, doing all that, and then going into the forest. Up until the Phantom Train. He can't leave once he's on that Phantom Train. But I don't think he comes with you afterwards to Narj. But anyway, yeah. So you all have a good night. We're going to try this again tomorrow. Same bat time, same bat channel.